Hey, this is Chris Menard. I have something advanced today in Microsoft Word. I have a one-page Word document, but assume it's 50 pages. My dress code is a heading style 1. Shoes is a heading style 2. So you can see that I have two heading 1s and four heading 2s. So when you put in that table of contents, which is usually on another page, there it is. I'm going to show you two tricks you can do with that table of contents. The first one is for some reason some people want to turn off these hyperlinks. So if I point to time off and click I will jump to time off. So let's do that first. Click inside your table of contents. The keyboard is Alt F9 and if you see all this those are called switches. The backslash H, the backslash Z that H is the hyperlink switch. So I'm going to hit delete once, delete twice, Alt F9 to get back, point, and it still says control and click. That's because I need to go to update table, update entire table, click OK. So now the hyperlinks do not work. So that's trick number one. The second trick I'm a big fan of, my heading twos, shoes, shirts, all that stuff. If you notice, the page numbers are showing. Also, the tab leaders are showing. So I'm going to click inside again. Alt F9. I'm going to just get rid of all these other switches in this example. And I'm going to write my own switch. Backslash, the letter N, a space bar, 2, dash 3. I didn't have any headings 3's, but that is saying... I'm going to suppress all the page numbers for my heading 2's and heading 3's. So in my actual case I could just do that, but I may add some heading 3's later. Alt F9, still showing, watch this. Cool. Anyway, I hope that helps. That's two neat tricks with your table of contents in Microsoft Word. Thank you.